it's a race with uh, really a lot of climbs, climbs from uh, maximum 2Ks. Yes. So and really small roads, so it's really hectic. And yeah, with the short climbs, it uh, it's uh, every five or 10K, it's a really uh, hard effort, which uh, really gets into the legs after 200Ks. And of course, there is a very special finish in Kauberg. Uh, is that to finish only for punchers? Or? Yeah, yeah, it's really a, a fin. The, the Kauberg is a one and a half K. Yes. And um, you really have to yeah, be able to have a punch uh, to finish there uh, in the first uh, position. But yeah, already before, normally when it's a sprint, it's maximum 15 guys, and uh, then the most fresh of that one uh, will win. Tell me about the ambience of the race. It, it looks crazy in Kauberg. There are a lot of spectators. Yeah, that's true. It's uh, Kauberg is also in the in the center of Falkenburg, and uh, and that's where all the bars are. So with uh, with nice weather, the people used to be in Falkenburg. They all uh, standing on the Kauberg. And also during the race, because it's a really small area where it takes place, so it's easy to cut the roads and see the race in, uh, in uh, more times than, uh, than once. There are two UCI World Tour uh, teams in, in the Netherlands, Rabobank and uh, Vacanzole DCM. Do you feel there is a special pressure between them? Uh, no, I don't think so, because... Uh, for Amsterdam Gold Race? Yeah, for Amsterdam Gold Race, for sure, they want to do good. But I think uh, uh, they both go for the victory. They not look, uh, look to each other uh, to, to kill the other team, like uh, a few years ago with uh, Panasonic and, uh, and uh, the team of Raas. But uh, yeah, for sure, those teams will be, will be really ambitious for that race. Because this is the main, this is the biggest Dutch race. Yeah, it's the biggest Dutch race, and uh, yeah, it's uh, the race with the biggest history in, uh, in uh, Holland.